Trailing suction hopper dredges like the Volvox Olympia are part of Van Oord's fleet of dredges. Launched in 2003, the Volvox Olympia has a hopper capacity of 4,870 cubic meters. Fully self-supporting, she provides accommodation for up to 22 crew members. Main propulsion is provided through twin controllable pitch propellers allowing a cruising speed of up to 13 knots. In combination with the main propulsion, the single tunnel thruster at the bow controls the accurate positioning of the vessel during the dredging cycle. At the dredging area, the speed drops to one to two knots and the suction pipe is launched. Once in position, seabed material suspended in water enters the drag head. The sand mixture is released into the hopper where sediment settles and superfluous water releases to sea. With the hopper filled, the suction pipe is recovered and the vessel sails to the project location. The vessel has four methods of emptying the hold. The first is to simply open the bottom doors and release her load. The second is through a floating pipeline. With the hose connected to the bow, the sand in the hold is refluidized. And via the deck line, pumped into the floating line to the reclamation area. third method again over the bow, but now releasing the sand mixture by using a method called rainbowing. The last method is to return the sand via the suction pipe. This allows controlled release of the material, accurately placed with limited turbidity of the surrounding waters.